Hello everyone, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we will learn how to move last element to front of a given linked list. Let's see the problem statement first. The problem statement says we have to write a C function that moves last element to front in a given singly linked list. Let's see some examples to demonstrate the above problem. In the first example, we have given a linked list 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. After moving last element to front, we get linked list as 5, 1, 2, 3, 4. In the second example, we have given a linked list 4, 3, 9, 1. After moving last element to front, we get linked list as 1, 4, 3, 9. Let's see the algorithm for the given problem statement. We declare two pointers last and sec last. Last stores the address of last node and sec last stores address of second last node. We traverse the linked list and store last and second last node. After the end of this loop, we do the following three operations. We make second last node as last node we set next of last node as head and make last node as head. Now let's see the C implementation of above algorithm. The return type of this function is void since it will not return anything. It will only modify head of the given linked list. The function takes only one argument, the head of the linked list. Note that here we are using double pointer while passing head because we change head of the linked list inside this function. If linked list is empty means head is null or if linked list contains only one node then we do nothing and simply return to the main function. After that we declare two pointers sec last and last. Sec last is initialized with null and last is initialized with head of the linked list. After this, we start traversing the linked list. After each iteration, we update the sec last and last pointer to store the second last node and last node of the linked list respectively. After this traversal, sec last will contain second last node and last will contain last node of the given linked list. Once we have traversed the whole linked list, we update next of second last node of linked list with null and we also update next of last node of linked list with the head of given linked list. Finally, head of the linked list is updated with last node of the given linked list and we get the modified linked list with last node as front node. Let's see sample example to test our algorithm. We have given a linked list 4, 3, 9, 1. Initially head will point to 4. We pass this head of the linked list in this function. Inside this function we will check whether head or head next is null or not. Since head next points to 3, it will not enter this if condition. After this, two pointers sec last and last is declared. Sec last is initialized with null and last is initialized with head of the linked list. We then start traversing the linked list. Initially, sec last will be null and last will point to 4. After first iteration, last will point to 3 and sec last will point to 4. After second iteration, last will point to 9 and sec last will point to 3. After third iteration, last will point to 1 and sec last will point to 9. Since next of last is null, we stop traversing the linked list. So we get second last node 
pointing to 9 and last node pointing to 1 for making second last node as last node of the linked list we set the next of sec last as null after setting next of sec last as null link between 9 and 1 will be broken and next of 9 will point to null this makes 9 as last node of the modified linked list next we set next of last as head node after setting next of last node as head node next of 1 will point to 4 final step is to change head pointer to point to last node of the given linked list after making last node as head node new head will point to 1 and our final modified linked list will look like 1 4 3 9 so this verifies our algorithm for moving last element to front of a given linked list time complexity of this algorithm is on where n is the number of nodes in the given linked list with this we end our tutorial thank you for watching please leave us your likes and comments